Uh, Mr. Gardner, the Delta Vision Foundation. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Uh, Charles Gardner, the Delta Vision Foundation. Um, I just wanted to take a moment to, again, uh, as others have, congratulate you on getting to this point. Uh, I know how much work uh, this has been for all of you as the council and particularly for staff. Um, I wanted to highlight three things that uh, I thought uh, were particularly uh, laudable about the effort over the last two and a half years. Um, the first is the effort that you've undertaken to uh, take the key, uh, several of the key concepts of the Delta Vision strategic plan, uh, first and foremost, the co-equal goals, and uh, begin to articulate what they mean uh, uh, for the future of the Delta, for the future of California. Um, I think that's uh, important progress that uh, is, is worthy of highlighting in the current version of the Delta plan. Um, the second is the process that you've used, um, the iterative approach um, it sets a model for uh, other agencies working on the Delta and, and other issues. Uh, uh, the transparency that that has encouraged, the level of engagement that that has allowed, uh, and the evolution, as other speakers have, have acknowledged, of, of uh, really developing things that are going to be workable for the whole state. Um, the third area is the effort to link actions together. This is a core principle of the Delta Vision Strategic Plan. The Delta is often described as a wicked problem, that you can't solve just pieces of it. You have to solve the whole thing. And um, if we are going to be successful this time around, we have to continue to link these things together. And I think you've, in, in some areas, you've, you've worked hard to figure out those, those linkages of water use efficiency and ecosystem restoration, uh, water supply, et cetera. Um, there is more work to do. Uh, obviously. So I would encourage adoption of the plan. Um, you've, you've deferred a number of the key issues uh, that, that we really need to be addressing in the near term and intermediate term. Um, the levies, as Mr. Nordoff was uh, mentioning this morning, uh, uh, is a critical issue that, that uh, needs attention immediately. It needed attention 30 years ago. And uh, uh, other parts of the state government have uh, avoided that issue. And I really hope that you folks can, can pick it up and, and move it forward. Um, a couple of other quick uh, acknowledgments. Near-term actions, I know you've deferred that. Uh, important to pick up. Uh, the performance measures, uh, we've got to start on them, but there's more work to be done. Um, the finance plan, and then above all, the implementation committee. The challenge of, of making that work and uh, making it an effective tool to continue the linkage and coordination that uh, is so critical to make, make this work. But um, I know there's more work to do. We're, we, are, we stand ready to help and, and provide our uh, expertise uh, as we can. So congratulations and uh, look forward to moving forward. Thank you, Mr. Thank Gardner. You. Appreciate that. Uh, 